It's officially February, which means it's Chocoholic Frolic Month. Amy's back from the Arc of Winnebago, Boone, Ogle Counties, and Judy is here from Quixotic Bakery because the Chocoholic Frolic has got to have baked goods in it, and Judy's making a lot of them, huh? Absolutely, <laughs> and we're so excited. You know, our providers every year really make the frolic happen. Yeah. Um, and of course, the the art can't happen without our fundraisers. <laughs> you know, we we're uh, grassroots works with people with individuals. Uh, with uh, um, intellectual and developmental disabilities. Mm -hmm. And um, really this makes all the difference for us, these fundraisers that we do. And the frolic is huge. Yeah. And so on February 29th this year, we're very Special excited day. on Leap Day. Mm -hmm. um, we're gonna have a chocolate crave cases. We have a to-go option for people um, that's $50, uh, or they can do a VIP event, which is the in-person, and that's a $100 donation to us. But they get the crave case at the end of the night and mixtape entertainment and amazing so appetizers, heavy appetizers from Perfectly Seasoned. Um, and so we're just really excited to, to have the community supporting us again. This is such a great example of some silver linings, I think, that like came out of the pandemic, right? That's when you switched from just the night of chocolate to the Crave Case. Yep. And now you're able to combine them both. Yes. And I mean, as much as I loved walking around and eating every single piece of candy and <laughs> chocolate and cake in the two hour span, yep. kind of nice to be able to pick to eat a few there and then take all that home. Right, it's made all the difference for yeah. us. So the to-go was a great pivot for us yeah. during during the pandemic. And so many people last year were saying, we want back in person. And we're yeah. like, well, we'll do a little in person. Yeah. And really we had such great support from the community saying this was this was yeah, fun. We love this it was combo. a lot of fun. And so people who want the to-go only, you know, that, that's still an option for them, but everybody gets the case at the end of the night, yes. which makes all the difference. Because like you said, when you're at the, when we were in person, mm -hmm. who could really walk around and taste 20 or 30 Only items? Only me, right? but it was really <laughs> hard. <laughs> But no, here yeah. you can you take it home, you spread it out you over a few days. You enjoy it a little more, kind of, and get to enjoy all of the work that everyone is doing when you get to say, okay, this yes. is from Quixotic Bakery instead of just like. Yes, so. yeah, yeah. You get a little bit more of that um, connection to our providers, which really make the difference for us. Yeah. And it's nice to be able to give them some some outside PR that they yeah. may not normally get with the community as well. So you have a lot of treats you brought, Judy. Let's start with the cookie that's gonna be in the Crave case. Uh, so we're gonna actually have two things okay. in the Crave two case things. this year. I did not bring one of them, so that's that would okay. be a little surprise. Uh, but this one is our 09 cookie. It's brand new for us. We just took a lot of research, but we came up with it. We call it 09 because it has none of the nine major allergens are recognized by the FDA. So it is gluten-free, dairy-free, soy-free, nut-free, and egg-free. Okay, I want to, I gotta see this up close. But it's completely delicious. But it's basically a chocolate chip cookie. <laughs> yeah, I'm gonna open it. Yeah. Okay, tell us what else you have, and these are things you can so just stop So then this, I brought you some of our Valentine things, um, our uh, heart-shaped sugar cookies, our Valentine party mix, uh, which is um, Czech cereal, pretzels, peanuts, and it's all tossed in white chocolate. And then we have our holiday oh, no. bars no. and some of our cake in a jar. Yeah, we have some amazing. fun flavors for that? Valentine's. I uh, brought our chocolate decadence, the Pretty in Pink, which is a new one for us. It's a strawberry so cake with a strawberry buttercream and then the red velvet. I love these and I love them. Um, in the summer, don't you do the stuff on the stick? The cake, yeah. Uh, yes. <laughs> with the ice cream. cream. We actually have those year round now. Oh, okay. In, in our you store, know what else they have? So. Dark chocolate ice cream. Have you ever had it? Mm -hmm. the, is it the Zanzibar? It is, uh, it's a cedar crust it's ice so cream, good. but it is a midnight dark chocolate. I love it. Mm -hmm. It's so, so good. As is this. I had to test it because when you say there's nothing in it, <laughs> I'm like, well, we have to try it just to see, but it actually is really, really good and so awesome to be able to include some people in your lives that aren't usually able to enjoy all the right. sweets. Um, yeah, we. that's one of the things we really aim for with our boxes is yeah. to make sure that there's a couple treats in there at least for sure. that everybody can really have. Yeah, yep. so make sure that you get those Crave Case tickets before they're gone and the in-person tickets to chalkrock.com is where you want to go and it's going to be so much fun and the calories don't even count anyway because it's on uh, 229 which right. isn't even a real day. <laughs> so it's your perfect. bonus day. It's perfect. Air Friday is next with Eyewitness News reporter Andrea Barone. We're making ranch pretzels. Can't wait to taste these too. We'll be right back.